tubers and I hope you're having a good day today. Today I'm doing another wish review for, of kitchen gadgets. I recently got these in the mail and I want to do a little review. So this is actually a three in one peeler and it switch sides basically. You press down on this little knob right here in the middle and it will give you three different peelers if you want to be fancy you know to make flowers like a radish flower or just you know if you're peeling carrots or even potato little thin potato slices for chips and then they have a regular straight peeler that you can just peel like you know if you just want to peel a carrot or a potato or a zucchini or a squash or an eggplant, anything that you want to peel. And now they have this other, this third, sorry, my tripod hasn't arrived yet from Wish, so I'm gonna do a review on that when I get it. Now this is a fine grade peeler with lines. And this is smaller, so if you wanna do carrots, you know, little carrot uh, peels for salad, or anything, it's very useful. And you could be used in some crafts too. And this is the bigger one. I don't know if you can see, my lighting's a little bit poor today. So here you have bigger teeth or wider space and they're bigger teeth. Now here we have <clears throat> a pocket maker. And this, sorry, the peeler was about a dollar and the shipping was a dollar. It was a little bit of a sale I got. So, and then here we have a pocket maker. I got three of them. I got a small one, a medium one, and this large one. And how they work basically, is you get dough and you press it into this little this little indentation here and then you press it like that for a few minutes and then it will come out my suggestion with these if you do get these or anything like these is you put some spray some non-cooking spray in them so the dough doesn't stick because sometimes it will stick and <clears throat> What I would do is put a little egg wash around your dough before you put the filling in. So when you press it like this, it will actually stick and form a nice seal because the egg wash acts like a glue. And these these are about a dollar or two. I'm not sure how much I paid for them, um, but I think they're the most they were at two dollars, and I got three of them, which was really you know nice. You got like I said, you have a big one, a medium one, and a small one. And they're good for making like little fruit pies or any type of filling, like little meat pies and stuff. You know, anything that you have at home. And last but not least is my favorite, which is a scooper. Now this came in three sizes. This is the medium size one I got. It was about three or four dollars with a dollar shipping. So it was about four or five dollars. And it's good because actually in the stores, they run about seven to like nine dollars, depending on where you go for the medium one. Now they do have a small one, which I really want because it's like a melon baller and you can use the smaller one for making truffles. This one I've used for making chocolate chip cookies and just any type of cookie that you know you can scoop and it does a really, really good job. I spray a little cooking spray to just, you know, so the dough releases a little easier. But this has many applications too. You can use this as a melon baller or a watermelon baller. You know, you can even use it as an ice cream scoop. So it's very useful. And I'll be ordering more stuff. Um, like I said, I have a tripod on the way. I did order a 64 gig memory card, and that was only like three, four dollars. And that was a really good steal because those cost a lot in the store. They're like between 10 and 20 dollars. So I'll let you know uh, when it comes and I will do another review. So hope you have a good day and please like and or subscribe to my channel. Thanks.